Hello, and welcome to part three of my series on the Dope for A121S stereo morphing filter. This time around, we'll listen to the bandpass and the high pass filters, as well as some patches using the delta and the morphing controls. In this first patch, I'm running a simple envelope and its inverted output into the common FM inputs of the filter. I've got both filters set to the low pass mode. And I've got resonance set to about two o'clock for both filters. I'll manually tweak the CFM input and the frequency input for both filters. Because the single CFM input is attenuating, it'll flip the polarity of the envelope sent to each filter. And now let's hear the bandpass filter sweeping our sawtooth wave. I'm increasing the resonance of both filters every time I sweep up and down. Once again, we're listening to both filters in stereo, but they're tuned to the exact same frequency. Here's our patch again, but this time I'm tweaking the morphing control for both filters simultaneously, as well as changing the frequency for both filters. Now I've got both filters in notch mode, and you can hear the envelope sweeping the frequency in different directions via the common FM input. And here's high pass mode for both filters.
both filters to about halfway between high pass and band pass modes. I love the way that the A121S lets you morph in a little bit of the frequency on the other side of the cutoff point. And this is full bandpass mode for both filters. And now let's listen to our high pass filter sweeping over the sawtooth wave. Notice that the high pass filter, just like the low pass, doesn't reduce the bottom end as I add resonance. This makes this filter a great option for filtering percussion and drum sounds. As the high resonance begins to react differently in each filter, we can start to hear the filter spreading out in stereo. Thanks again for tuning in. Next time around, we're going to listen more closely to the morphing, and we'll take a look at some really weird patches in our next installment of the A121S. Please like and subscribe, wiggle that little bell, and consider joining my Patreon to help me make more videos and more weird modular music. Thanks so much, see you next time.